and Brandon got together, Brandon is now moving on, looking for other women to sleep with. Watch. I give up everything for my husband, Brandon. When I found out I was pregnant with our daughter, I gave up my job as an account specialist because it was too much stress on my marriage. I devoted my life to being the best mother and wife that I could possibly be. But now everything's getting thrown back in my face because I know Brandon's cheating on me. The morning after Brandon asked me to marry him, I found out he proposed with another woman's wedding ring. Then I found text messages in his phone to another woman and he was trying to hook up with her. And now I'm afraid that the man that I thought was my soulmate is just a really good con man. I love Brandon so much, but if he's lying, I'm gone. Okay. Now, look at these pictures. You look we happy. were happy. We were very happy until I found out he was lying. A lying about what? Everything. Literally everything. Everything girls was numbers, a... girls pictures, girls everything. So I don't even know why he's crying right now. Like, why are you crying? <laughs> so obviously the state of your marriage is not good. It's it's horrible, Mari. I mean, we are miserable. We fight every day. I I don't leave the house. He goes and does whatever he wants while I'm stuck there wondering where he's at. Okay. I I, I like the way you all met, okay? Buffalo Wild Wings? Buffalo Wild Wings, yeah. yes. And I quit my job. Um, and I needed a beer. I was super, super stressed out. Right. So I went to Buffalo Wild Wings, and he was there with my buddies. Right. He pretty much bribed me. Said if I what eat a whole mean? tray of blazing hot wings, the if hottest that you can get. Yeah. So, so he said if I ate this whole tray then of blazing go hot him. wild wings. He would take me out that night, right. pay for all my drinks to me. It was a win-win. Right. So but you did. I did. And then you went out with him. I went out with him that night, and, and he was so loud and arrogant i ditched him you did i did i laughed <laughs> well i so. don't understand if you ditched him that night i read that two months later you got married we did well he kept texting me and texting me and um asking to go out and my buddy was like he's a really good guy go do it so i did right and that night we were together ever since right and then when he proposed to you with another another woman another girl's wedding ring another woman's wedding ring text message from her in the morning right. saying that she needed it back. Do you know? I swear. I swear. Maybe, you know, he just wanted to make you feel good. He was going to get you the real one. No, no. I mean, he did he got, take me and did get this get, one designed. That's not. It's gorgeous. That's your But ring. I mean, if you mess up that bad, I think you probably okay. need to. Now, now uh, uh, he works, Brandon works in a business where uh, he's not only is a, a property manager who so has to deal with properties. He's, he's a locksmith. He's a locksmith. So he gets calls all, all the time, right. all hours of the night. Right. I mean, one, two, three, four, five in the morning. It's yeah. a cheater's dream, really, because <laughs> you get the call and you can just leave. So that's where you think he is. He's oh, out. yeah. I mean, not all the time, obviously, but there's nights where I'll wake up and he's just gone and I don't know where he's at. How long does it take to unlock a car? Didn't you not hours. Didn't you find him one night? I found him outside of the bar holding another girl's face, Mari. This close to her face. say something to me and he grabbed her face to console her to console to her to console her and it was someone he had slept with before oh. but he is the king of i don't know so when you ask him about it oh i don't know i don't know i don't remember and then you found some text messages where he wanted to hook up with a woman on christmas day mari on christmas day we we're together and it was with a girl um, that we both knew and we were drinking and he wouldn't go home with me so i was like i'm going home i don't feel good the second I left, he was trying to go home with her. I see. The second I left, right here, look at this. I, I'm just, I wish I was there with you. He could have been in bed with me. Right. That's what pisses me off. Okay. When you were pregnant with your daughter, what was he doing? Well, we didn't have sex for a long period of time when I was pregnant, obviously, because he was getting it somewhere else. Oh, so. I see. Um, but he came home from work another day where he's gone all day.